damn brat. I'll sue. <laughs> It's Jessica and welcome to Persona 5. This was a game that I wanted to bring on the channel for a long while, but I wasn't sure if I could do it, uh, mainly because I, I don't know if anyone has heard about the controversy about Persona 5 when it first came out in North America. There was about some iffy rules about if we could do Let's Plays and stuff like that. Um, so I decided to live stream this on Twitch. But then, I couldn't finish the game because there were a lot of people who were just being rude to me about playing this game. They were trying to spoil it for me, they were trying to tell me how to play the game, or yelling at me because I didn't play it the same way they did, so I stopped playing it. So, in reality, I only played like a couple of hours of this game. Um, I didn't even get to the heart of it yet because, because of that. So, I wanted to start over a brand new Let's Play here on YouTube. I really don't remember what the hell happened because I played this like a while ago, <laughs> so my memory of it is kind of shoddy. I do know the gist of it, but I never got a chance to finish this game, so I want to finish it here. So I hope you guys don't mind that the beginning part, I'm not blind to it like I've seen it before. This story is a work of fiction. Similarities between characters or events to persons living or dead in your world are purely coincidental. Yes, a disclaimer. Only those who have agreed to the above have the privilege of partaking in this game. I like this voice. Who's the voice actor? I agree. What if I don't agree? Is it going to kick me out to the, the main contract menu? contract <laughs> has been sealed. The world is not as it should be. It's filled with distortion, and ruin can no longer be avoided. Great, that's nice. Comforting. Those who oppose fate and desire change. From time to time, they were referred to as tricksters. You are the trickster. Now is the time to rise against the abyss of distortion. Also, a side note, I've never played any other Persona game. Like, this is the first one I'm playing. I've never played the other Persona games. So... I know they're not directly connected to one another, but I maybe I should just play them at some point. I don't know. <laughs> Casino. Uh-oh. Something's happening. When people start to panic, you know it's a bad deal. <laughs> There's something here. Yeah, there is something there. He's kind of like Batman. Joker? There he is! Our main character! Joker! Why- also, why was he standing there? Of course they're gonna find him! Alright. Now get running! Yes! This is our only chance! Stay calm! You can get away now! We'll retrieve the briefcase on our end. Uh-oh. Hmm? Who's that? Don't worry about us. Just concentrate on getting away. Okay, escape from the casino. Jump! Above that crowd earlier with an excellent Nice work as always, Joker. Jump over here. Uh-oh. I love Persona's soundtrack, it's so good. Uh I should Yeah, I was just saying, maybe I should just leave. Run! Uh oh. Oh, goodness. Take him down, Joker. <laughs> they look like Heartless from Kingdom Hearts. That's what they look like. Wow, so handsome. <laughs> That's supposed to be like a scorpion, centaur, whatever. I don't know. Okay. Uh, attack. Take this. Critical. Ow. Everyone else, head to the Can I use persona? 
restaurantes. I should have done it in the beginning. It's gonna take me a while to remember how to play this properly, because I've never played a turn-based RPG in a really long time. Uh-oh! Hello! Alright, I'm going. You should be able to get out of there! Hurry! Come on, man. Dude, can you even hear us? I'm okay. Don't worry, I'm picking up everyone's voices. Just go, Joker. Alright, run. Why is there so many like stickers on the wall? Uh this way. Uh oh. Okay, let's go, let's go. Huh? Oh! What? Uh, up ahead, stop! This is bad. Hi, Joker! You'll never get away if you just keep fighting! Hide in the shadows and sneak past when you see an opening. Hey, are you sure he came this way? Understood. I will continue the search. Now's your chance! Run for the stairs! Uh, let's go! I should probably turn off those notifications. <laughs> Damn, how many, like, guards do they have? Or, like, security people? For a casino? That's a little bit weird, isn't it? Run! Uh-oh. Something wrong? The exit should be up ahead. You're there. That's just how it is. After that commotion, the bottom floor is completely closed off. Hey, can you make it? Over there! Uh-oh. There's no way to run! There's a place to jump! <laughs> See ya. <laughs> there he goes! Bye! Huh, what a show off. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Get out of there, Joker! Uh oh. Enemies here? What's wrong? Deep readings. It can't be. What Did they got it wrong? Joker, can you handle this? Joker. Oh no! Capture him! Let's go! Go go go! Oh my God! <laughs> it's like too many of them too. Yeah, I can handle this. <laughs> Hurry up! Why is he smiling? That's like so many police officers. Uh oh. Oh, man. Why do they need that many officers? I never thought about that. Like, why so many? Because, like... Suspect secure. I guess they haven't been able to catch Joker for a while. Expect to find some kid. You have your teammate to thank for this. You were sold out. <gasps> Who sold them out? Suspect confirmed. Cuff it. Well... There you go. Okay, if I remember correctly, he's like a teenage yes, kid, isn't he? Was too strong. Wake him up. Damn, my goodness. Um, hi. We're dozing off. You still don't get it, do you? Give it up! Ow! And he's a kid and they're just like beating him Quiet. like that. What? You want another shot? Huh? What about the camera? Are you thinking it can be used as video evidence? Um. Oh, um. I'm not gonna say anything. Question. Ah, oh, okay, maybe I should have. Obstruction of justice, blackmail, defamation, possession of weapons. 
Manslaughter too, yeah? What? We killed someone? Talk about the works. The thing that all those crimes were led by a punk like this. And you seem to be enjoying every second of it. Huh? I was enjoying it? Everything's hazy, I can't remember. Oh, wow. Okay, set the difficulty. For those who want unbalance between exciting gameplay and riveting story, you can change the difficulty at any time. The choice will not affect the story. Okay, I'm... I think you've already guys know this. So I, I usually play my games between easy and normal because I like to focus on the story rather than the gameplay, especially if I'm recording a video because I don't want to get frustrated. Uh, you know, it's, it, doesn't it takes away from me enjoying the game. So... I may play it on easy, I don't know, but I'll see because I may change it back to normal later on, but for now I'll keep it easy because like I just want it to be casual, whatever, call me a casual if you want, but I rather enjoy the game, but we'll see. If, it, if it's way too easy, I'm just going to switch back to normal, I, I don't know. You should know your place. Oh, he has all these, like, red markings on his wrist, too. Oh, this poor kid. They beat him so much. It's what? Confession under your name. No, but I, I... He doesn't even remember doing any of this. I see. I need your hand to sign this, but... Oh! I don't care if you end up losing a leg. Okay, okay, relax! Asshole. Don't expect to walk out of here in one piece. We are going to make you understand. One must take full responsibility for their actions. Okay, so we have to sign it. Okay. Here's the thing. When I... <laughs> <laughs> when I played this game a while ago, I named him Kinky Coon for the jokes, and I kind of want to name him that again. So that's gonna be his name. No one judge him. That is his name, alright? Don't kink shame him. Alright. We'll name him Kinky. This is his name. Kinky Coon. <laughs> Kinky Coon. That's my name. <laughs> I'm finished. Excuse me, but this area is off. I'm Nijima from the public prosecutor's office. Hey, Nijima! The prosecutor's office? What business do you have here? Prosecuting the wit uh, witness? The guilty party? I don't know, that's her job? Just let me through. It's urgent. There's something I need to confirm with the suspect. I like how the, the title of her name is Women in Business Suit. <laughs> Nijima-san, I believe this case is no longer in your jurisdiction. Besides... You prosecutor sign Nijima. There's a call from your director. Hurry and get it over with. To be frank, you're being an inconvenience. <sighs> I thought I ordered you to stand by. I'm responsible for this case, yet I'm not even being allowed in interrogation. I'm calling because I knew you'd bring it up. I will not be convinced unless I confirm it for myself. This is my case. Yeah, that's right. You tell him. <sighs> Good luck to you then. I won't be expecting much though. Uh, prosecutor, I forgot to mention something important. Your time will be cut short. We can't permit you to talk with him for long. Why? So you can continue to beat Kinky? Is that why? <sighs> it's for your own sake. Yeah, I'm His sure it is. His are unknown. After all, we don't even know if it's safe to simply meet and speak with him. I understand. I didn't expect it'd be you. You'll be answering my questions this Wait, time. Wait, she knows him? <sighs> Those bastards. Can you hear me? It seems you've been through a lot. Almost anything can happen here. And I can't stop them. Yeah, they're like drugging up everyone. That's why I need you to answer me honestly. What was your objective? Why did you cause such a major incident? 
I didn't think it was a prank from the get-go, but I couldn't assemble a case for prosecution. It's because I couldn't figure out the method behind it. Of course you couldn't. Why do you want to know? Why do you want to know? This isn't an issue of whether or not it can be used in court. I need to know. This is my case, after all. It seems you're coherent. When and where did you find out about that world? How is it even possible to steal another's heart? Now, tell me your account- How, how does she know all of this? Start from the very beginning. Guys, get ready. This is about to be weird. <laughs> all of it's gonna be weird. Pretty butterfly. You are held captive, a prisoner of fate to a future that has been sealed in advance. This is truly an unjust game. Your chances of winning are almost none. But if my voice is reaching you, there may yet be a possibility open to you. I beg you, please overcome this game and save the world. The key to victory lies within the memories of your bonds. The truth that you and your friends grasped, it all began that day, when the game was started half a year ago. For the sake of your world's future, as well as your own, Six months ago. you must remember. Level one, kinky! <laughs> So this was six months ago, I think? This is the last stop for this line. Please transfer here for all subway lines. The doors to your left will open. Ew! Understand that part. That's gotta be a joke. You really love all that occult stuff. But in Asia, it's just like <laughs> laws are taken very seriously. I know Japan is like one country that takes laws very seriously too, right? That's why I guess that's why they're beating him in the prison, right? Um, when they captured Kinky Kun over here. But that guy, I'll sue, but you're harassing another person. Like, what's wrong with you? to me i would think i'm on like drugs or something <laughs> what the heck <laughs> everyone's frozen am i xavier from x-men the hell is that oh yeah this is just a normal monday everyone this is how we get to school every day Start my phone or something. <laughs> okay. Head to your new lodging. Exit the subway station. Excuse me. Um. Okay, I'm not really good at navigating through games. I think everyone is completely aware of it, so I'm probably gonna get lost. Starting today, so Jiro Sakura will be taking care of me. His house should be in the back streets of this residential area. I can talk to people also to help me locate it. Sir, can you help? Yes? 
Uh, I want to ask for directions. Mm, you want to get to a residence of that address? In the back alley, a bit further back. Take a right after that apartment with the stairs. Uh, take a right after the apartment with the stairs. This one, right? Over here? Hmm? Is it this one? The nameplate here says Sakura, so it looks like this might be Sojiro Sakura's house. Hello? Even after ringing the doorbell, it doesn't look like anyone will answer the door. Maybe he's gone out? Looks like no one's home! Oh, yeah, Sakura's son usually is at his cafe around this time. Well, LeBlanc's in the back alley, so I should make my other deliveries first. Hmm, next I need to take this package to... Alright, so I gotta go to his cafe, which is where exactly? Oh, it's a dog! Was there another, um, accident? I see policemen over there. Oh, he's just watching to make sure everyone's safe. It'd be scary if something like that happened again, though. Let's hurry home. The hell happened? The dog though, can I pet it? <laughs> okay, so I have to go to a cafe. Where the hell is this cafe? I see a cafe icon on the map. So, this way? This is it, yeah, LeBlanc, here we go. Looks like this is LeBlanc. Yeah, let's go inside. Don't stand outside like a weirdo. Did that say coffee and curry at the top? That's a really weird combination. was driven down an opposing lane with its customers still in it. The citizens can't live in peace if this keeps up. Oh. oh. How frightening. Oh, God. What could be going on? Didn't something similar happen just the other day? So what, crazy trains are just taken off all of a sudden? Hmm. Vertical is name of the shellfish used for farming pearl. He's not even paying attention. <laughs> oh, right. They did say that was today. Well, we'll be going now. The payment's on the table. Thanks for coming. Uh, this place is in the back alley, so there's no worries of a car crashing in here. A what now? There's been a string of those rampage accidents, you know. I just hope that none happen around here. That's probably foreshadowing that it will probably happen around here. <laughs> none of my concern. <laughs> well, see you next time. Oh, four hours for just a single cup of joe. So, you're the guy. So, you're kinky! <laughs> <laughs> Why did I name him this? <laughs> um, please take care of me. Is Sakura-san here? Is it? I don't know. That is him. So, like, do I say this? Uh-huh. I'm Sojiro Sakura. You'll be in my custody over the next year. I was wondering what kind of unruly kid would show up. But you're the one, huh? I'm an unruly kid, huh? Have you been told? A customer of mine and your parents know each other, and, well, not that that matters. Follow me. What the hell are you talking about? Wow, you give me to the dusty-ass attic! Seriously? I'll at least give you sheets for your bed. Hmm? You look like you want to say something. It's big! It's cluttered! Do I be rude? That's the thing, because this guy's like taking care of me it's a big room it's on you to clean up the rest what i'll be leaving after i lock up each day you'll be alone at night but don't do anything stupid i'll throw you out if you cause any trouble okay now then i got the gist of your situation you protected some woman from a man forcing himself on her he got injured then sued you right yeah he said i'm gonna sue <laughs> <laughs> That's what you get for sticking your nose in a matter between two adults. You did injure him, yeah? You heard the part where he was assaulting her, right? And now that you've got a criminal record, you were expelled from your high school. 
Okay, see, this is what I mean. In, in Asia, they take the laws extremely seriously. Even if you had good intentions, if you break the law, they will hammer down on you very hard. And considering Kinky Kun is a kid, they take it even more seriously because they don't want kids to be like degenerates and whatever. It's just, it's a very, it's very different compared to like North America and stuff like that. So I just, it just surprises me also, but not really that they're kind of like overlooking the fact that this creepy dude was sexually harassing a woman, but okay. The courts ordered you to transfer and move out here, which your parents also approved. In other words, they got rid of you for being a pain in the ass. Uh, thanks. It's best you not talk about anything unnecessary. I am in the restaurant business, you know. Behave yourself for the year. If nothing happens, your probation will be lifted. Uh, a whole year? Cause any problems and you'll be sent straight to Juvie. We'll be going to Shujin tomorrow. Uh, Shujin? Shujin Academy. It's a the school. school you'll be attending. Okay. We'll introduce ourselves properly to the staff there. There's rarely a place to accept someone like you, you know? Yeah, because I'm a degenerate for helping a lady who was in trouble. What a waste of my Sunday. Your luggage arrived earlier. I left them over there. Uh, thanks, I guess. And you can get the sense that everyone's probably gonna treat Kinky in a way too because like he's like the bad kid and whatever i'll be living here starting today i should check out what's in here all right it's the cardboard box sent from back home it's full of clothes and daily necessities i'll change into more comfortable clothes for now cool look at us all right uh examine messy table it's a table covered in dust if i draw a line in the dust with my finger it'll probably be really easy to see Man, we're living in this, like, janky attic. <laughs> it's a desk with stacked books on top. No one can use this as a desk while it's like this. I should start cleaning first. Yeah, let's clean. Might as well if we're gonna live here for a whole year. This poor guy! <laughs> oh. D did that look better? I don't know. It feels like it's the same. I have no idea. All right, it's Saturday evening. It's late. It seems like I've been cleaning for a while. Seriously. What the heck? I heard you making all sorts of noise up here, but I didn't think you were cleaning. Are you impressed? Uh -huh. Actually, the place doesn't look too bad. Though, it's only natural you'd want to keep your room tidy. Why did you go to bed for tonight? You don't have anything better to do, right? I'm going to close the shop and get myself out of here. I'm gonna head back then. I won't be looking after- I, I won't be the one looking after you if you get sick staying up too late. You got that? Gee, thanks! Sleeping in your bed will move forward one day. We should probably just go to sleep anyway, because it's still the beginning. Change and go to sleep. Arrest. Trial. Criminal record. Damn brat! I'll sue! I'll sue! Just remember that guy. <laughs> Still, I couldn't just let that go. Oh my god. Well, can, can we sue that guy for like harassing that lady? <sighs> that day. I had to go home early. Oh, it's uh, we're remembering it. Okay. Just get in the car. Ew! Stop it! See, even sounds like a freaking creeper. Mm -hmm. I can hear a man and a woman arguing in the distance. I think they're just up ahead. How dare you Stop it! Let me go! No! Don't give me that sh It looks like that drunk man is bothering that woman. Ow! Please stop! And this is why I always say, ladies, even men too, they could get kidnapped as well. Try to learn how to defend yourself, because in this situation, I will clock this man in the face. She's in danger. I have to save her. Also, people should, like, call the police. Like, Kinky should have called the police, too. A waste of time. You think you're worth causing me trouble? Huh? I'll... I'll call the police! 
Call him if you want. The police are my. Oh great! Not gonna take no you wonder. Serious. You know what's? It's interesting. That's probably why they they even booked him too because the police work for this guy. Someone called the cops, huh? Get in the car. Incompetent fools like you just need to shut your mouths and follow where I steer this country. Who the hell is this guy anyway? What are you looking at? Get out of my face. It ain't a show. Get lost, kid. See? This is all because you're so damn slow. Get in the car. Phone, hello. Hmm, it's that weird app that somehow ended up on my phone. Yeah, you know what? At this point, I would just return my phone and be like, Can I get a new one, please? That icon looks almost like an eye. I thought I deleted it. And, and Kinky just thinks, like, Oh, it's a virus. No, it's not a big deal. Just delete it. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. Hmm? Um... Where am I? Hello? Now it's really kinky coon if you get what I mean. Okay, uh... <laughs> Uh, hi? What the hell is happening? So it's totally not weird. This is totally not weird whatsoever. This game is normal, everyone. <laughs> so you've come too, inmate. The you in reality is currently fast asleep. You are only experiencing this as a dream. You're in the presence of our master. Stand up straight. Welcome. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. It is a room that only those who are bound by a contract may enter. I am Igor, the master of this place. Remember it well. Okay, Igor. I summoned you to speak of important matters. It involves your life as well. Uh, important matters? I don't think let me out will uh, help us at this point. Still, this is a surprise. The state of this room reflects the state of your own heart. To think a prison would appear as such. You truly are a prisoner of fate. In the near future, there is no mistake that ruin awaits you. A ruin? I speak of the end to everything. Cool, great. However, there is a means to oppose such a fate. You must be rehabilitated, rehabilitated toward freedom. That is your only means to avoid ruin. Do you have the resolve to challenge the distortion of the world? Uh, wait, what? Because honestly, that's me too. <laughs> you didn't decline, hmm. Very well. I didn't say yes, though. <laughs> Allow me to observe the path of your rehabilitation. Ah, pardon me for not introducing the others. To your right is Caroline. To your left, Justine. They serve as wardens here. Ha! Try and struggle as hard as you like! The duty of wardens is to protect inmates. We are also your collaborators. O that okay. Is, if you remain obedient. This is not I weird. I shall explain the roles of these two at another occasion. Now then, it seems the night is waning. It is almost time. 
Take your time to slowly come to understand this place. We will surely meet again, eventually. That's probably our, live, our alarm clock, right? Now hurry up and go back to sleep. I, I'm still confused about that part the, with the whole thing with Igor and stuff. Because, again, I didn't play this game long enough to, like, understand everything. So, we'll see. I had a strange dream. Ruin? Re rehabilitation? What does it mean? Hey. Looks like you're up. Nice hat. He's oh. got a nice outfit on. Well then, let's go introduce ourselves properly to the staff about your transfer. So the school you're attending is Ay Ayo Ayama? Ayama? It's in the Ayama district. It'll cost you a bit to ride the train there, and then the route transfer are a pain. I'll drive you there, but just for today. Let's go. He's basically saying you got to get your own ride when you go to school. Sheesh! Men aren't usually allowed in my passenger seat. Okay. We're here. Do me a favor and behave yourself, all right? Don't get me wrong. I don't care what happens to you. Thanks. <laughs> Just don't cause me any trouble. To reiterate, just so we're clear, you will immediately be expelled if you cause any problems. Why does the principal like look like Wilson Fisk? Um, Spider-Man, where are you? <laughs> Honestly, I hesitated on accepting someone like you, but there were some circumstances on our side. You might have done a variety of things in hiding in your hometown, but you will behave yourself here. If you are thrown out from our school, there will be no place for you to go. Keep that in mind. This is the teacher in charge of your class. I'm Sadayo Kawakami. Hello. Here's your student ID. Be sure to read the school rules. Any violations will send you straight to the guidance office. And if by chance you cause any problems, I won't be able to protect you at all. That is your promise, yes, Principal Kobayakawa? Mm-hmm. He is responsible for all his actions. But really, though, why me? There should have been better candidates. Why me? Why do I have to take care of, like, the freaking kid who is a degenerate? <laughs> it was a sudden transfer, and your class was the only one that had an opening. If you're done explaining things, mind if we get going? I got a store to get back to. Sakura-san, please keep a close eye on him. Don't let him cause any trouble outside. Well... I'll be sure to have a serious talk about the situation he's in. <sighs> Come to the faculty office when you arrive at school tomorrow. I'll show you to your classroom. Oh, okay. Looks like we're gonna have a fun time here at school. <sighs> They're treating you like some kind of nuisance. I guess that's what it cut. I guess that's what it means to have a criminal record. Turns out your past follows you wherever you go. Yeah, because I was helping someone. By the way, if you don't get expelled now, I won't hesitate to kick you out. Got it? Um, I'll be careful. I want to be. I want to be mean so badly, but right now, we kind of need a place to stay, so I can't be so much of an ass. Hmm. <sighs> School never changes, huh? Come on, we're going home. What a troublesome situation. Jersey-wearing teacher, these freaking names. I can't believe they pushed someone with a record on me. A male teacher would be better suited for this. Why in the world was someone like that admitted here? Oh my god, everyone's gonna be so mean to Kinky when he gets to school. Who knows? It was the principal's decision. I was told that it's for the school's reputation. That they host a guy who has a criminal record? I would have thought that my volleyball team has contributed more than enough to cover that. That's certainly true. Be careful, okay? Then again, if anything were to happen, I'd kick out a student like that right away. Well, I keep wishing that he'd just end up not coming to school. Still, that isn't something I should be saying as a teacher. Well, I should be returning to practice. Oh, right. The tournament's coming up, isn't it? 
Having such high expectations placed on you by others is quite a problem in itself. We'll have to work hard to make up for the track team, too. Yes, that's true. Why was that conversation so weird? I don't know why. That was really weird. In my class. Oh, traffic's not moving at all. You're taking the train starting tomorrow. You already said that. So, how was it? The school, I mean. Think you can manage? It seems fun. It'll be tough. Uh, we'll see, because I don't even know how everyone's going to be reacting to me, because they're probably going to be like, it's the degenerate kid or something. Now listen up. Don't even think of doing anything stupid. I wasn't. Still, you were expelled once already. <laughs> to think you'd re-enroll at a different one. It's not like anyone will be sympathetic with you. Yeah, that's what I thought. If that's what it was like at school. People might say stuff about me in the future, too. What a troublesome kid I've taken in. Why did you take me in? If you're piss pissed off about it. And I just happened to agree to it. Uh, I've already been paid for it, too, after all. So he, j he just, he was just given money to take care of us. A subway has derailed at Shibuya Station, greatly affecting the timetable. Again? Oh, another accident. Damn, where do we move to? Every There's like an accident every day. So that's why it's so crowded. There's been a lot of those lately. The inbound train will soon be arriving at platform number one. Please wait behind the Um Yeah, technical difficulties. This guy's like gonna kill everyone. Jesus! That was direct footage from the accident. Damn! According to the police, the engineer's life was not in danger despite his injuries. After questioning, even he could not explain his high speed when approaching the station. No further comment. Oh, so he wasn't dead? But why was he like bleeding from the mouth? It's less of an operating accident and more of a crime of the company and the government. Site inspectors apparently reported all of this six months ago. The deterioration of the tracks and the ATC. Seems a railway company and the Ministry of Transport both turned a blind eye to the truth. There's no way they can hide. This That's the same lady from earlier, isn't it? Now on to our main story. With this derailment accident, as well as other recent incidents of unknown motive, concern is spreading among the general public. Just what could be causing such a drastic change so suddenly in these people? SNN. Has Everything's linked. That's what you're thinking, correct? Hmm. Oh well. Are you free? You and I haven't gone for a drink in a while. Thank you, sir. But I have another meeting to attend. I must be going. She has nice hair. It's like gray. I think that's cool. Oh, who's this? For me. Is it a case? Not quite. I want your opinion on something. Sure. Your judgment is quite often correct, though. Can we discuss this over sushi, perhaps? You are making a student work late, after all. <laughs> Conveyor belt only. Aww. He's trying to get a free meal. <laughs> all right, we're back. Please. Damn, to think there'd be that much traffic. What a waste of time. I wasn't able to open the cafe today. Well, whatever. Fine. Just head upstairs. There's something I need to give to you. Talk about a gruesome accident. 80 people were involved. It's a diary. Make sure you write in it. You may be under probation. There's no special limitations on what you do in particular. Besides following the law, that is. However, 
I'm obligated to report on you. Which is why I'm having you record your daily activities. Oh. Hey, what's up? I'm about to leave right now. Don't worry. I'll be there in no time. Uh huh? I'll see you soon. Well, I'm off. I'll lock the place up. So do whatever you want for the rest of the night. Oh, but don't mess up my store. If something goes missing, I'll hand you right over to the cops. Great, and even if we didn't take it, he'd still do it. <laughs> you got school tomorrow. You better head off to bed, all right? So we gotta write in this journal every day. I should do as I'm told for now. For now? I should write down the what happened today in my diary. That ringing sound isn't coming from my cell phone. Downstairs. Alright, it's coming from downstairs. Let's go. Uh... Where's your phone? Oh, it's outside. Hang on. Hang on! Coming! Yo, it's me. Uh, who is this? Sheesh, you forgot my voice already? It's Sakura. Uh, I closed up shop, but I forgot to flip the sign to close. It's too much of a hassle for me to go back, so you flip the sign for me. <laughs> I don't feel like it. You called the public phone? Um, okay, got it. I, I don't want to fight with him. He's kind of annoying. Well, I'm sure no one's gonna come, even if it says open. Thank goodness I was able to reach you. Sorry I made it a habit not to save guys' numbers on my cell phone. Anyway, I'm glad you answered the phone over the shop. Okay, then. I'm leaving you in charge of the door sign. Again, I'm trying to make Kinky's Coon's life easier, so we'll just flip the sign. Wow. Okay, so... Do I just flip it? There we go. Hopefully we don't have, like, a weird dream again. I need to take the train to school. Yojin Jaya Ayoyama Ichimo de Ichimoe? Ichimoe? I don't know how to say this. Transfer. It looks like I need to go out to Shibuya, then transfer there. More news about that subway accident. Sounds like a lot of people were hurt. I bet this will affect the time tables for tomorrow, too. The strange app I saw last night is back. It keeps showing up. I thought I erased it two times already. I should probably reboot my phone just in case. I would return the whole thing! <laughs> Go back to the store and be like, take this demonic phone back. My eyelids are starting to get heavy. All right, now it's Monday. I have school starting today. Hopefully I can get there without getting lost. I don't want to be late on my first day. I should head out now. Oh my goodness, I feel bad for him because I know what that's like, actually getting lost and stuff like that. that that's my worst nightmare that's happened to me when I was going to college, so... Oh, I gotta talk to him. Okay. Oh, so you're actually going to school? Here, I'll feed you. Just make sure you finish it before customers start coming in. Uh, curry? What's the reaction for? Just eat it. It's true, it's food. Better than nothing. Just eat something. I can taste complex flavors within the bold spiciness. It's time for you to go. Thanks for the meal! Huh, turns out you do have manners after all. Yeah, you wouldn't know because you didn't get to know me, dude! Hurry over to school. You'll have to believe you get lost on the way. Alright, let's get out of here. Flip- Oh, flip the sign outside to open for me. Um, okay, got it. I, I really want to be a smartass so badly. Don't forget to do that for me, alright? Now, you better hurry on and out. You're going to be late if you get lost, country boy. There you go, flipped it open for you. Oh, okay, so I got to go to the nearest station, which is, I don't know where that is. Can I ask the police officer again? Hmm, something the matter? How do I get to the train station? Did you get, um, did you get lost? Yojin Jaya station is in the opposite direction. You see the main road over there, right? Uh, get over there and the station will be nearby. Best hurry if you want to take the train. The schedules are a bit off due to, yester due to yesterday's accident. So this way? Oh yeah, it is this way. Okay, got it. 
Oh, I hate taking the subways. I live in the city too and it freaks me out. I hate taking it. Because I, I'm always scared I'm getting on the wrong stop or like the wrong station. I don't like it. Too many people. There are, too many, there are so many people crowded in this tiny car. Turns out the rumors about Tokyo subway are true. They're showing the news on the LCD screen. It seems like there are still some lingering effects of yesterday's accident. Okay. Um, Shibuya, uh, change to Ginza, Ginza line. Ginza line? Ginza line, up here, okay. Uh, wrong side? Where do I go? Oh no, hang on. There we go, this way. Ginza line. Um... I can't read with all these freaking... This way. No, it should be a central street. That's not it. Ah. Uh, Ginza line is this way. Uh, is this right? Yeah, this is right. Alright, let's go. Um... Says they're cleaning right now. I should probably look for another way. What? They're cleaning! Oh my goodness. Where the hell do I go then? Can I go this way? No, this is going up to the street, isn't it? No. Wait, maybe I can go through here? Because sometimes I have a station on top, outside. Um... Help, I'm lost! Oh, here. Can I go through here? Am I going the right way? <laughs> um... This one. Yeah. Oh, I think I'm going the right way. Alright, now we gotta wait for the train. I'm doing so good! I, I, you know, this is exactly how I feel in real life. I panic really easily when trying to take public transportation. <laughs> oh, man. Did it say it was going to rain today? Huh, it's raining outside? It just started all of a sudden. This is why I hate the early spring. That reminds me. Did he take an umbrella? No. Hmm? Who are you talking about? <laughs> Don't mind me. Does he care about us taking an umbrella? Oh, my God. So. What'll it be? One house blend, please. The effects of yesterday's subway accident continues on today, as various lines suffer delays and... There's been a lot of nasty accidents lately. You know, I mean the subway accident that the news is talking about. My co-worker got caught up in it and is in the hospital now. But that aside, it's kind of creepy. The people who caused these accidents supposedly went crazy all of a sudden. I heard that some of them suffered from nervous breakdowns during interrogation. Huh. And he doesn't seem to be phased by it, but it's definitely something else. They all said that they don't remember it happening, so that's kind of weird. Ayama Ichome? Where, where am I now? Uh, it took some time, but I finally made it. Okay, so we gotta go to the surface so we can go to school. Oh yeah, these are our classmates. You can see we have the same uniform. Alright, cool. We don't have an umbrella. The app's there again. Uh, hi. Oh my god, it's a pretty girl. <laughs> He's just staring at her like a creeper. <laughs> Stop staring at her, Kinky! You're so weird! <laughs> Good morning. 
You want me to give you a ride to school? You got to be late. That's the guy from sure, earlier. Thank you. Do you need a lift too? Uh huh? Uh, nah. But I would say, uh, okay, well, you know what? I wouldn't go with this guy either, so not gonna. Her face, though. That's not a good sign. Damn it. Screw that perfect teacher. <laughs> perfect teacher? What do you want? <laughs> Vulgar boy. You planning on ratting me out to Kamashita? Uh, what do you mean? Huh? In that car just now, it was Kamoshida. That's the teacher. The creepy guy with a square jaw. He does whatever the hell he wants. Who does he think he is? The king of a castle? Don't you agree? Uh, which castle? <laughs> uh. It's just a saying. Hmm? Wait, you don't know Kamoshida? No, I'm new. Are you for real? You're from Shujin, right? Uh, you go to Shujin too? What? No other high school's got a uniform like this. Huh. A second year, huh? We're the same grade then. Never seen you before, though. Oh. You a transfer student? <laughs> he just got just on now. <laughs> <laughs> then no wonder you don't know him. This rain ain't too bad. You better hurry up or we'll be late. Why is it always like the edgy <sighs> boys who become the best friend of the protagonist? I feel lightheaded for some reason. Ugh, my head hurts. Damn it. I want to go home. That was weird. What was that? I think we're going back to the interrogation room, yeah. There was a terrible subway accident that day. You remember it, don't you? I assume you know of the uproar that the public calls the psychotic breakdown incidents. Um, I might. You say that like it's none of your business. It was all over the news and one of the victims included a teacher at your high school. I've no doubt you heard about it. On that day, were you still an ordinary student? What do you mean? Let me change the question. You transferred to Shujin Academy, correct? An ordinary prep school that could be found in any city. That's what it should have been. What happened around that time? Tell me everything, truthfully. That's our phone. See, this is why you return the demonic phone right away. You don't freaking leave it in your phone. Leave it in your pocket and act like everything's fine. Um. Huh? Boy, if you look at your freaking bag. <laughs> Are we at Hogwarts? <laughs> we didn't come the wrong way, though. Yeah, this should be right. What's going on here? I guess we'll just have to go and ask. Hmm. I would turn around and walk the other way. That's what I would do. are about to happen guys Th that's weird where's the school oh uh, this is our school it should be it said Shujin on the gate what's going on here out of service where did we end up the sign was for the school, right? Uh, what's going on here? This is weird. Are we on drugs? I, uh, I don't know. I want to know. 
Jeez, you freaked me out. Um, yeah, totally. This guy's in full armor and he's holding a sword and he's wearing a weird mask. Who are you? You a student? Yeah, he looks like a student. Man, your costume's impressive. Don't go near him! Is that armor real? <laughs> Come on, don't just stand there, say something. Hey, what's going on? Is this must be a prank? No, uh, uh, is this school stuff? Yeah, that's not school stuff. What is this? Dude, I don't know. This is real. C calm down. It's time out, man. We gotta run. I agree. Uh, got it. Let's get out of here. Run. <laughs> Stop standing around and run. Uh oh. Yeah. What's with these guys? You're gonna break my bones, damn it! The hell you think you're yeah. Take them away! Jesus! Okay, guys, we're gonna end this first episode of Persona 5 right here. So Again, I hope you guys are going to enjoy this Let's Play series. It's not something that I'm going to upload every day. It's just something that I want to upload uh, once in a while to mix it up on the channel. And I will finish this. It's just a matter of I got to record these videos longer than I normally do to get through all of it. I think that's what I should really do. Uh, hour, hour and a half kind of videos. We'll see how it goes. But again... Uh, if you've never played Persona 5 before, please let me know in the comments what you think because I would love to hear what uh, you think about this game. Again, this is my first Persona uh, game ever, so I'm really excited to see what's going to happen next. Again, because I never finished it and I want to know what happens with uh, Joker and Kinky, I should say, and the rest of the characters we're going to meet later on. Anyway, if you guys enjoyed this video, remember to leave a like, let me know in the comments what you think, and be sure to subscribe and hit the bell button so you know when I upload the next episode of Persona 5. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next one.